digestion of food. How tasting starts digesting. You start breaking down the food for your body to use even before you take your first bite. Breaking down the food so that your body can use it is called digestion. All the body parts that work to digest the food are the digestive system. There are many parts as you can see and it works on your chewed up food for a few hours. It depends on what you have eaten. You know how the food is chewed upon and where the salivary glands are. As we chew the food, it breaks down into small particles. The saliva mixes with it and the food forms a soft ball. The soft ball of food is called bolus. This is what we swallow. Once the chewing is done, the tongue helps us to swallow the food. The food goes down the food pipe. It goes down slowly and falls into the stomach. Do you remember that there is a windpipe in your throat too? The windpipe carries air to the lungs and the food pipe carries food to the stomach. Now, when you are ready to swallow, a door covers the windpipe so that food cannot go into the lungs. This door is actually a small muscle. It is called the epiglottis. So the epiglottis covers the windpipe and then food goes down the food pipe. The food pipe is called the esophagus. It is about 10 inches long. If you drink something too fast, you may start to cough. This happens when the epiglottis doesn't have enough time to flop down on the windpipe. So you cough to throw that food out of your windpipe. Once you swallow the food, it doesn't drop right into your stomach. It takes about 3 seconds as the muscles push the food into the stomach. The muscles push the food down by squeezing it. This action is called peristalsis. Peristalsis is so strong that we can swallow a glass of water standing on our head. The food travels through our whole digestive system. This squeezing of the muscles moves food ahead. We know that digestion of food begins as soon as we put food in our mouth. In the mouth, our teeth bite and grind the food. Because of this, food is broken down into very small pieces. As we chew and grind food, saliva mixes with the food. The food forms a soft ball called bolus. The bolus is pushed into the food pipe by the tongue. The food pipe is called the esophagus. And after that, the rest of the digestive system takes over. 